Hello guys, George here for Gino Z Productions and today on the Leicester manager mode uh, we're going to be going through the friendlies. So the first one is against some Dutch team but uh, the gameplay from this episode is pretty cool. Got some nice goals but um, this team actually came pretty close there in the first half and then they they were much better than me in the first half. I was still getting used to it. I mean I've only had the game for a couple of days and they came pretty close but um, Raheem Sterling here using his pace really well, cutting it back, and he gave it to Beckford, who gave it to catch Nick Litch, and he was so unlucky there, but they managed to get it out, but Dans gets it back in, and look at this, what a goal from catching Nick Litch, what an absolute pile drive with his weak foot as well, so we've got to get a replay on that, it's a brilliant goal, on the volley as well, man, that's a great goal, and at half time it was 1-0, I love that camera angle, it's pretty awesome to be and uh, next up we have Beckford on the ball here, he comes so close. I'm not fond of Beckford, he's okay, he just seems really sluggish on the ball. Uh, but there's, these Dean does come pretty close and that was <laughs> pretty unlucky for them, but Suso does pretty well there. And uh, that's a little 1-2 with Captain Nick Litch, who was actually a pretty decent winger, he's, quite, not, he's not that good on the ball, but I love doing that. That's funny, put the cross in, uh, knocks something. Hit <laughs> it back in and then uh, Nugent managed to get it back in. So that was a nice finish by Nugent. Just it down in quick volley. And that made it 2 0, but they actually did manage to get a goal back in the last minute. They just caught me out of a nice little through ball and a decent finish. Uh, but we did actually have one final chance. And that was Suso here. He was running through and he hit the shot. It was well saved. And then it came out to Dan's, and it was another good save. But I finished 2 1 in the end. Pretty happy with that, to be honest. I mean, we came up against a decent team. I think they're like a sort of a mid table Dutch team. But the next team is against Vitoria. I think they're from Portugal. And for some reason, that number 15 has no name. Um, okay. But uh, this game started off even better. As you see here, Suso running through from midfield, chesting it down, and then on a half volley. Good save, though. And they managed to clear it. But, you know, Suso is a pretty decent player, we've got some nice and field players. But then look at this from Nugent, great goal. Absolute beaut of a finish, I mean, the bird walk celebration. I love doing that, it's pretty fun. But look at that for a finish, it's absolutely brilliant. And then Suso doing, I love that new um, hold, I think it's that uh, left bumper, or right bumper. But uh, catching Nate Litch there, with another great goal, he just turns the defender easily and smashes it into the corner. You see here again, great first touch. Hello. Very nice finish, and at half time it was 2 0. So, two quick fire goals in the middle of the first half. But this team did actually come close again. They were penetrating my back line quite a lot in the second half. And it wasn't, if it wasn't for Schmeichel, we would have been uh, down even more. But Sterling here, using his pace, and uh, he managed to get it across to uh, drink water. And I decided to sweat it out, and I missed. Hmm. I just thought I'd put that in, it was pretty funny. But this is Suso's pace, uh, Suso, Sterling's pace, and he has very good pace, and he was unlucky there not to hit the target. You see there, we have a man on the floor, and uh, they didn't really care, this team, they were not very sporting at all. I uh, thought Michael made a good save, but then they managed to get it in, which is a little bit annoying, so that was 2-1. And they came close again to equalising, I mean, it doesn't matter, it's just a friendly, but... I'm pretty happy with the win we did get in the end because that was a very nice save by Schmeichel and Sterling actually with a great first touch there he managed to get through on goal but he just couldn't get the killer goal but it, in the end it did just stay 2-1 which is pretty nice to be fair uh, Schmeichel did, played really well and then we had an offer from Birmingham to take uh, Jeffrey Schlupp on loan so I thought I'd accept that because he's not quite ready yet I don't think uh, but moving on to our final friendly, it's against Premier League West Ham, and I decided to start Vardy up front and Marshall. Uh, but they actually came close in the first half, it wasn't that good really, it took a while to get the game going, and that was basically their best chance of the game. But Ben Marshall doing some nice bit of trickery there. Uh, Neil Dans here, with the fake shot, just takes out um, Tompkins of the game and smashes it into the corner, that was a really nice goal from Neil Dans. He's actually a pretty decent uh, midfielder. And then uh, King went on a crazy run and he was unlucky. Good save by uh, Jaskalainen. But then I thought I'd shut this in. What a miss from Andy Carroll. And then that meant at half time it was 1 0. 
Uh, Sterling played a nice ball into Vardy, who just beat the defender. Great save, and I don't know how on earth he saved that. I mean, Marshall literally shot it straight at him, from, but from the resulting corner, yeah, yeah, I just let you guys sort of take that in. That was really, really weird, but I love the new free kicks on this game. They're really cool, so I thought I'd you know, put this into the video, because I reckon it's pretty cool. It would have been really nice if it worked, but it didn't. But, you know, it would have been nice if it did. But you see here uh, Marshall running down the wing and he crosses it in to Beckford who is a lethal threat in the air and he smashes it in with his head. Uh, then O'Neill gets a decent chance in the last minute for I think that was Andy Carroll. But it did finish 3-0. Oh crap, did I not put Marshall's goal in? I might not have done anyway. We got an offer for Richie Wellens. But I'm sorry if I did, I'm probably just going crazy. But guys, if you have um, any transfer suggestions, leave them in the comments. And uh, thanks for watching. Goodbye.